Hey guys, I am Gautam and welcome to GKMix. In this video, I am going to talk about the cycle action tricks and how to remember the cycle action system and the axial, equatorial and equatorial axial. Actually, these are very important for IIT jam, net, gate. It is a basic topic. So you need to clear this topic also, right? So before we begin, we, I just want to uh, tell you something that I have made a lot of videos on IIT jam syllabus and the topic or is solution i have uh, provide i have already provided you so i just want to change something that whenever i will make other videos other chapter videos i will not tell you about the solutions because uh, it makes the video very long so some of you uh, suggested me to make the video shorter so that's why i will provide you the solution paper in the pdf form in my blog as i have done before so and in those videos I will tell you the important topics and the important questions I will discuss and something like that. So would you like to watch the, that kind of video? Just let me know by clicking the i button and give your reports. Right. If you have any problem regarding those in understanding any uh, question from the PDF. So just take a screenshot and post it on my Facebook group. Okay. So I will definitely clear your concept. Okay. However, let's start. So, what is cycloaxin? Cycloaxin is six membering. Its formula is C six A is twelve, and it looks like planar, but actually it's not. The three carbon are on the same plane, and the other three carbon are on the another plane. Okay, so we just need to write cycloaxin like this. So this, this, and this gapping one carbon. These are uh, on the same plane, and these, these, and these are. Uh, on the another plane and by flipping we can draw like this okay so here are these these and this same plane these these and this another plane on the another plane okay so here also each corner has two hydrogen okay so these two hydrogen divided into two parts axial hydrogen and equatorial hydrogen axial hydrogen is represented by a I am representing and equatorial hydrogen is represented by E. So if we draw the system like this, we will get the structure. So the this type of hydrogen, first, first let me discuss about x and y axis. This is you know this is y axis and this is x axis. Every y axis hydrogen, y axis hydrogen along the y axis will be axial hydrogen and other hydrogen will be equatorial hydrogen. Okay, so these, this, this, this this and this are axial hydrogen here also same uh, system is true and the other will be equatorial hydrogen so how to draw actually how to draw this system from this or this so there is a simple method that for each corner there is four corner outside corner here also and here also so corner you first draw axial hydrogen okay then draw for this corner below to above side above to below side this is above this is above carbon and this is below carbon above carbon below side below carbon above side so next coming to this and this so from this the here from this carbon you need to draw towards the corner carbon so this and you know this this will be along the z axis and also from this carbon you need to draw like this this way in this way so here will be equatorial carbon same is true for this system also okay so now coming to different examples so first maybe c is one two system trans one two system c is one three system trans one three system c is one four trans one four system so how to remember this i am explaining you by giving an example okay let's take c is one two dimethyl cycloxane now let's talk about this whole system and how to remember this so just remember a e a a a a a e a e a axial equatorial similarly axial 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 equatorial axial equatorial axial axial and also axial equatorial its flipping form flipped form is equatorial axial so if this is this hydrogen is axial this is equatorial so this hydrogen will be this axial this is equatorial then this will go to axial here and this will go to 
tutorial here okay so it is just its flip form okay uh, you just need to remember this for this series and you will easily remember this just opposite one axial axial equatorial equatorial axial equatorial equatorial axial okay so how to remember just remember a e a a a a a e a e a just short form and how this all are uh, related to this one so c trans c trans c trans 1 2 1 2 c 1 2 trans 1 2 c 1 3 trans 1 3 c 1 4 trans 1 4 okay so c 1 2 a e a e a a a e a e a c 1 2 trans 1 2 c 1 3 trans 1 3 c 1 4 trans 1 4 okay this is the right way to remember and this is a tricky way to remember all of this so now let's talk about c 1 2 dimethyl cyclohexane so first c 1 2 means in the normal form we can write this like this way if we draw cyclohexane okay now say this is one this is two carbon number one carbon number two so one two that is one two means c is one two that means a e or e a so every oh, whatever you like you can write anything a e or e a so if this is a axial so methyl 1 methyl is axial and here also nothing so hydrogen and another methyl will be equatorial so c is 3 right here this is equatorial okay and this is axial so every other in every other bond there will be hydrogen okay so this is the right way to remember and if says c is or trans 1 3 system so if this trans 1 3 dimethyl cyclohexane so what will be the right structure first let's let's draw the system okay now let's numbering this 1 2 and this is 3 okay so 1 3 that means 1 trans 1 3 a e or e a so if you give this as a I am ignoring the hydrogen okay so don't think that everywhere methyl group is present just I am ignoring the hydrogen so 1 and 3 this system so here also axial and this is equatorial so here also this is axial bond this is equatorial bond so here is axial this is equatorial and if, so this is trans on 3 system okay so you can draw all of this I want to give you some home task and draw, draw them and just post it on my Facebook group okay so the system will be trans 1 4 cyclohexane dimethyl cyclohexane and c is 1 3 c is 1 3 cyclohexane diol okay so just draw this two structure and post it on my facebook group so just remember these two above group this is cis and these two above and below group so this is the relation will be trans okay in my next video i will give you the application of this uh, system according to jam syllabus okay so stay tuned thank you thanks for watching